Howdy friends, Travis here, and today we're going to take a look at the Low Pro Pro Tactic 450AW camera bag. Let's roll the intro. Alright, I don't have an intro, but if I did, that's where it would go. It sounds cool anyway. Um, this bag is a backpack style camera bag, and I've used all sorts of bags. I've used backpacks, I've used the sling bags, I've used the roller bags with the handles and the wheels. Love those bags. You can fit a ton of stuff in those bags. The problem is, is you can't put those bags under the seat, so you have to put them in the carry-on when you travel. And what I've found is that I try to go as minimalistic as I can when I travel. You know, all the gear, obviously, but um, if I can put a carry-on up above with my clothes, usually I can fit my clothes, slider, and my tripod in my overhead bag, and then all my camera gear in a backpack that fits under the seat if need be. Um, what I love about this bag is it's more rigid than your typical uh, camera backpack. You know, usually the last one I had anyway, it was a great bag. I could fit tons of stuff in it, but it was it was more flimsy, and so it wouldn't it wouldn't uh, it didn't it didn't hold its shape. This bag is super has some nice rigidness to it. You know, it's got some oomph. You know, and I can step away and this bag won't fall down on me. So it sits up on its own, which is really nice. Um, lots of access points in this bag. Uh, you have a top uh, access point, which is great. I'll just show you that right now. Um, just unzipper these. Boom. Access point. Need your camera? Right here. Good to go. So if you need a quick shot, always have access to your camera body. Here, there's... Uh, you got some pockets, and here's a little SD card slot here. Why anybody would put an SD card here, I don't know. Maybe safe, safe keepings, maybe as a backup. I wouldn't, personally. But this little lid pocket right here is where I keep my SD cards. Right in here, I know they're safe. Also, not a bad place for the passport. Throw that in there, too. Safe. You know no one's going to steal it. Um, and this, it's rigid up here, so if you bonk this or it drops on its side, you don't have to worry about your camera body head getting, getting beefed at. Also, um, on the other access points, on the side here, we have, um, we have an access point here. So you could put a camera body here or anything that you want. Quick access. There's a pocket on the side here. This is nice. It's got a little key dongle thing here. Love that. Put your keys in there. Um, what I like about this bag is it's there's not like massively weird pockets where you're going to get lost. So I like this. I know I'm going to put my keys there. There's the pocket. The other side's exactly the same uh, in that there's a quick access pocket here. Oh, look, a microphone. Might need a microphone. There it is, quick, boom, got it. Also, another pocket here on the side, it has one of these little elastic things. Maybe a good place for your wallet, cell phone, perhaps. Um, so there's three access points, and I'll get to the other access point in a second, but I wanna show the, the outside of the bag. Um, it's really cool, you've got, you know, it's hard. Again, it's got some beef to it. These are actually little webbing straps all over the bag here where you can um, put in these little pouches that come with the bag. So these little pouches, there's three of them. You've got one with a little tripod foot. And what's cool is it's got Velcro. So you can Velcro. This is a beefy Velcro too. Um, put it down here, anywhere in here, and you got some uh, some points to attach your pockets. Also has it along the side here too, which is pretty cool. Um, if you look at the uh, top of the bag, it's got this really nice handle with some rubber on it. And then at the bottom, it's got another handle, which is great, because if you are putting this in the overhead, it's really easy um, to take, put up and to take down. Also, another little secret cool thing at this, on this bag is on the bottom, in its own little pouch that's attached to the bag, you have a little rain fly, which is pretty cool. So if it's downpouring, um, you just put this on, and then when it's dry, you just put it back in here, and you don't have to worry about it getting lost because it is attached to the bag. 
on the back side of the bag is the straps, backpack straps. Um, pretty nice. It's got this, uh, you know, wicking stuff here. So if you're a sweater, it should take care of that for you. Um, it's got a nice adjustable sternum strap here, which is great. It also comes with a hip belt. Um, I took it off because it just gets in the way. I don't use it. It just gets in the way of, of stuff. So um, I took it off, but it, it does come with one. It's included. Now the fourth access point, which is actually going to be your main access point, is on the back side, which is kind of cool that it's not on the front because, you know, for people who are looking to try to get in your bag or whatever, um, if the bag's on you, there's no way they're getting into the main pocket of this bag. So this unzips. Um, this bag does have YKK zippers, so they're good zippers. You know they're going to last. Fold this open and boom! Look at all this room. Clamshell design. You have a pocket up here for your laptop. 15-inch laptop goes in here. And then you have your... What, what's nice about these pockets on the lid is they're see-through. So you've got pocket for your uh, whatever. I put uh, some HDMI cables in this one. This one's empty right now. I've got ND filters um, in this pocket, which is kind of nice. And then it's just total clamshell design. Again, if I... Uh, top of the bag here, my camera that I showed for the quick access from the top. This is the Panasonic G85 with the 12 to 35 millimeter f2.8 lens on here. Um, ready to go and also I have another camera body the Canon 5D uh, 5D Mark III body here and uh, I've got some lenses so got these little pouches all these dividers are customizable so you can just go in here and move stuff around and kind of make this bag fit to you know your organization um, 35 to 100 f2.8 Lumix lens um, Got the little secret weapon in here. It's the 25 millimeter Lumix lens, um, f 1.7. Great for interviews. Um, got a video light. Never know when you're ne gonna need a little light. Um, back side of the bag, I've got a hard drive, G Tech hard drive. Underneath that is my audio kit. So I've got this. Uh, I've got my Sennheiser G3 lav set up. And I keep it in this hot pink bag because if I'm on location someplace and I'm like, oh, where'd I put my microphone? It's in the hot pink bag. Kind of hard to miss. Underneath that, the Zoom H5. And what I like about this is, well, the, the Panasonic G85 doesn't have an audio um, monitoring out. There's no headphone jack in that camera. But it does have a microphone in. So what I do is I run the audio from the Sennheiser into the Zoom and go line out of the zoom into the camera um, and then I can listen this has a headphone jack so I can monitor the audio and I can record the, uh, a backup track if I need to um, so that way I have the audio going into the camera and back up just in case and then down here I've got this little Tascam DR10 microphone and this thing is pretty sweet because um, you show up to an interview and Johnny decides to bring his friend and didn't tell you. Um, you've got an extra microphone in here um, that records to actually to a little SD card. So it's a you can use this as a backup microphone or as a second re uh, microphone if you need to for uh, an audio situation that you weren't so ready for. Um, also back here, I've got the Canon 24 to 105. Uh, lens for the 5D Mark III, awesome lens. Heavy though. I mean, if you look at this lens compared to this lens, 35 to 100, f2.8, stabilized, to this stabilized f4 lens, it's there's some definite oomph to this lens. Awesome lens though. Um, and then back here, I've got just a a. Uh, Laptop charger and some AA batteries. Over here, I've got my trusty GoPro. Where'd it go? Here it is. Always have a GoPro in my bag because you never know when you're going to need it. Little GoPro stand, selfie stick kind of thing. And then a new addition to the kit, which I really like, is a um, place for all my batteries. Put all my batteries and chargers in here so I know 
where to go in my bag when I need a battery. And then when I get back to the hotel or get home and I need to charge all my stuff, I know that everything's in this pouch. So good addition to the kit here that I really like. Um, so that's about it for the bag. I mean, it's, it's beefy and it holds a ton of stuff. And uh, I'm looking forward to using it more. Um, but for my needs, I think this bag is going to be pretty much perfect. So friends, the low pro, pro tactic, 450 AW. Hope you found this useful. Click the subscribe button and uh, we'll see you down the road. Cheers.